NLC India Limited is a Navratna Central Public Sector Enterprise under the administrative control of Ministry of Coal, Government of India. Currently, the Government of India shareholding is 79.20%. NLC India Limited was incorporated in 1956 and for the past more than 66 years, continuously contributing for the growth of the nation and Tamil Nadu in mining and power generation. NLC India started its operations in Naiveli in Tamil Nadu initially and spread at Pan India level, putting its establishments in five states and serving the power requirements of more than 10 states. NLC India Limited initially started with lignite mining and lignite based power generation and now diversified its operation into coal mining, coal based power generation, renewable power generation, trading of power and also into consulting services in mining, thermal and renewables. NLCL presently having mining capacity of 52 MTPA, out of that 32 MTPA of lignite and 20 MTPA of coal and total power generation capacity of 6061 megawatt with lignite based thermal generation of 3640 megawatt coal based thermal generation of 1000 megawatt and renewable energy of 1421 megawatts. NLC India has been consistently paying dividend since more than two decades. Role of NLCIL in building the local economy. At present in NLCIL Naiveli, about 25,000 persons including contract workmen are working and more than 80 percent belongs to Kadalore and nearby districts. About 1 lakh families are being benefited indirectly due to Naiveli projects. Good educational institutions are functioning in Naiveli with the patronage of NLC India Limited to educate the children of employees and surrounding villages in the best possible way. Tanjatko, the government of Tamil Nadu is purchasing about 62 percent that is 3135 megawatt including RE installations of the electricity produced by NLC India Limited. NLCAL is supplying power to Tangent Co at low cost thereby contributing significantly to the development of the state. The role in local employability and skill development. As mentioned earlier, at present in NLCAL, Naiveli about 25,000 persons including contract laborers are working and more than 80 percent belong to Kadalore and nearby districts. Apart from this, every year around 1300 persons are undergoing apprenticeship in different categories, graduate apprenticeship, technician apprenticeship and diploma apprenticeship, trade apprenticeship for ITI holders and training for freshers who pass 10th standard. NLCIL established an ITI in Naiveli in December 2021 which offers four trades, electrician, fitter, welder, mechanic, refrigeration and air conditioner with intake capacity of 168 students. Every year, skill development training is provided to 600 youth in light motor vehicle and commercial vehicle driving, electrician, solar photovoltaic installation, metal arc welding, data entry, fashion jewelry, tailoring, incense stick manufacturing, etc. by engaging National Skill Development Corporation certified training providers. NLCAL has entered an MOU with Annamalai University Chidambaram, Tamil Nadu to conduct diploma in mining course with an annual intake of 60 seats, out of which 50 percent seats are allocated to wards of project affected people and half of the tuition fee is being borne by NLCIL. NLCIL is imparting training every year to the employees and contract workmen to upgrade their skill sets. During the year 2021-22, around 6,700 workmen have been trained. NLCL hospital conducts CRRI, compulsory rotatory residential internship program since 2019 with an intake of 20 medical students, including those who have completed MBBS abroad, of which 50 percent seats are earmarked for applicants from surrounding villages 
and for PAP and their dependents. Coming to the expansion plans of NLCIL, as per our corporate plan approved by the board, we have set high growth target to become energy major with 17,171 megawatt power generation capacity with our own fuel security of lignite mining capacity of 84 million tons per annum by 2030. The ongoing projects as on date are the Gattampur Dharmal Power Project of 3 into 660 megawatt, NLC Talabera Dharmal Power Project 3 into 800 megawatt, Pachwara South Coal Black of 9 metric tons per annum capacity, 150 megawatt hybrid renewable energy project, 510 megawatt solar under CPSU scheme and new innovative projects like overbud into M sand 0.42 MTPA, lignite to methanol 0.4 MTPA and the TPS2 second expansion thermal power project of 2 into 660 megawatt which is first thermal power station uh, in lignite of 660 megawatt capacity. NLCL's upcoming projects are 2000 megawatt ultra mega renewable energy power park, 500 megawatt solar power under CPSC scheme, 1000 megawatt solar at Assam, mine 3 with production of 11.50 million tons per annum and lignite to hydrogen projects. On environmental front, electrostatic precipitators ESPs have been installed at all the thermal power stations of NLC to remove ash particles from exhaust gas and they are operating of greater than 99 percent efficiency. In addition to comply with the Ministry of Environment and Forest revised emission norms, it is proposed to install fluidized gas desulphurization FGD technology at thermal units. As per the latest study reports of CEA and MOEF, out of all locations, Naivali is in less polluted area under the category C. In Naivali, lignite is mined through open cast mine after up obtaining environmental clearance from the ministry. NLCL has established 13 air ambient monitoring stations in Naivali township and surrounding villages for monitoring the ambient air quality levels. The ambient air quality is well within the norms prescribed by State Pollution Control Board. The water quality is also being monitored by State Pollution Control Board and NLCAL. Areas where lignite has been mined are filled and leveled with excavated soil and being used for developing afforestation and agriculture purpose. About 2243 hectares of afforestation have been developed in this way. Around 1.87 crore plants have been planted in Naivali township area and reclaimed areas to protect the environment. 